hear my question but for those of you who knows how it is to drive uh, in the United States and Canada if you come to a crossing with a red light um, is it always okay to go to the right to turn to the right uh, in that crossing even if you have a red light if you stop first or do you need to wait for a green signal if there aren't any green arrows uh, green and red arrows that is be nice to get an answer for that uh, so please uh, if you know please answer in the comment section let's place ourselves in the middle Sacramento or, or perhaps it is the opposite I don't know well a lot of red lights it is if you look at these green lights there there are no arrows uh, arrow, arrows to the to the right or anything like that so would it be okay to stop and go to the right even if it was red there that is what I'm curious about Star truck dealer. Uh, I never get into those trucks, even if there are Western Star trucks in the game, and I've driven a few, but that's not my favorite. But I guess it's a big brand uh, in North America.
eliminates a lot of straight highway driving uh, because that is it's not the funniest uh, thing to, to drive uh, and it's probably not the funniest uh, thing to watch either but uh, since I want to do it uh, as uh, authentic as possible and uh, I want to explore the map uh, in, uh, in an authentic way uh, I need to, to uh, do, it, do it like this unfortunately sometimes I end up driving the same roads that I've driven and uh, sometimes I visit the same places where I've been before but uh, yeah that's how it is that's life accidents on the way it's um, it has been too many of them earlier so far that's a nice trailer adjustments on the steering wheel can uh, can make you go to the left or to the right quite quite heavily so um, it's actually really easy to to uh, go over the lines and especially if you do, do it like this with the camera uh, speak at the same time it's easy to trying to do my best and for those of you who drives both uh, uh, American Truck Simulator and Euro, uh, uh, Euro Truck Simulator I don't know if you have noticed uh, that the AI drivers in uh, the United States and Canada is um, much more polite than in the Euro Truck Simulator. They they come in a yeah. I know I'm running out of fuel. I will try to find a place to stop and refuel. Um, they drive fast and they will not let you out uh, if you come, fr uh, for example, from the if you come from the right and will have to go out on a freeway or a highway they will not just let you out like that they are better at that in uh, American Truck Simulator
for those of you who don't know I am uh, I'm living in Sweden I'm from Sweden and uh, here in this country we uh, we currently have is it going yeah we currently have the highest price for diesel and uh, petrol at least diesel in the world so uh, filling up your car or truck or whatever in this country is uh, not cheap we don't measure in gallons here we measure in liter but uh, i think we have over two dollars in per liter so we are ready for uh, the next oh, let's see if we can get out here head for the highway again Field. Here we come. Full of diesel and on our way. I put it on 60 again. Five miles above the speed limit. speeding tickets for that in uh, Sweden you can at least go on the bigger uh, bigger uh, roads on uh, perhaps not in, in the city and around schools and parks and things like that but uh, on every norm, not normal road with uh, higher speed you can at least go 10 kilometers an hour too fast without getting a, a fine. Bakersfield on uh, the road signs, which is good. Then we know two things: we are on the right way, and we are not that far from from our goal. And uh, yeah, so far it's been okay. No big uh, things to ride home about. Actually, I've not been to Bakersfield in this game. I don't think that I have, at least. <coughs> that is uh, one good thing with this uh, journey, even if I've driven here before. I know that I was playing uh, American Truck Simulator a few years ago, and uh, I hated to go to Bakersfield because I had some mod collisions there, so the map was always uh, broken there in, when I play. Uh, I, uh, I am a sucker for trying out mods and, uh, well, it's not always a good thing. You can get mod crashes pretty easy then, at least if you don't know what you are doing. And, admit I don't but um, well hopefully
thankfully I learn and uh, I will hope I don't jinx anything here but uh, I've had uh, okay we are going right here trying new mods all the time but I have not had any big issues uh, with the map at least so uh, that's a good thing and I must say it's a lot of uh, fire trucks on the roads and here we are in Bakersfield Burgers. I really like this this uh, American Truck Simulator map. Very nice done. And for those of you who follows these uh, American Truck Simulator videos of mine, but. The other ones. I also drive uh, American Truck Simulator Convoy with a friend of mine. And in these videos or those videos, we uh, talk Swedish. So, well, I I cannot blame you for uh, for not watching because Swedish for those of you who don't Swedish uh, might be a strange strange. Uh, language. I, d I really hope that it, it doesn't uh, sound like uh, the chefs in the Muppet Show, but uh, <laughs> of course it's not easy to understand. Uh, we are going to the Tesla store that we have here. And um, here on our right side. spot. Oh, it's a pretty easy parking spot this one. So hopefully it will be okay to park here. I will go up on this and you see we cannot get to let's see if we can reverse into place here looks pretty good this perhaps let's activate the handbrake It's just to uh, attach the trailer like this, and then we are ready. So, 252 miles. Uh, we earned $11,146, and we are almost at the new level. So, uh, good. I guess that. The two miles above 250 was when I stopped for refueling. My friends, uh, thank you for coming with me on this journey from uh, Sacramento to Bakersfield. Um, 
Uh, I hope you enjoyed the ride when we went here, this uh, road here, uh, Sacramento up there and Bakersfield. Um, I uh, am looking forward to see you again and I hope that you will check in on me again. So, um, yeah, until the next time, take care, everyone. See you. Bye-bye.